Good morning, students. In this video, we are going to solve sub questions six and nine of question number one. Now, here we have to multiply these two binomials by using identity. Now, students, here a square plus b square in first bracket in second bracket minus a square plus b square. Students, we can write here b square plus a square. Because a square plus b square and b square plus a square both are equal. And in second bracket we can write b square minus a square. Here second term we we can write as first term and this first term we can write as second term. Now students here in first bracket addition of two terms and here subtraction of the same terms. Therefore here we can apply third identity. Therefore, by using third identity, and third identity is a plus b in first bracket, and in second bracket a minus b, which is equal to a square minus b square. Now, friends, if in this identity, if we put a is equal to b square and b is equal to a square. Then put a is equal to b square and b is equal to a square. Here first term is b square, therefore a is equal to b square. Here second term is a square, therefore b is equal to a square. Then therefore a plus b, therefore b square plus a square. In first bracket and in second bracket a minus b, therefore b square minus a square. Now, friends, RHS part here a square and a is equal to b square, therefore in bracket we can write b square and a square means here bracket square. Now, minus here b, b is equal to a square, therefore in place of b we can write a square. And here b square means here bracket square. Now, students, if you observe this LHS part, this LHS part is equal to this one. Now we have to simplify this one. Now, students, here bracket here power raised to power. Therefore, here we have to use exponent and power rule. Here power raised to power means here we have to multiply these two powers. Therefore b raised to 2, raised to 2 means 2 into 2, 4. Therefore, b raised to 4 minus a raised to power 2, raised to power 2 means multiplication of these two powers. Therefore, a raised to 4. Therefore, students, we can say that b square plus a square in first bracket b square minus a square is equal to b raised to 4 minus a raised to 4. And this equal to here equal sign. Therefore, multiplication of these two brackets here, this expression is equal to this expression. Therefore, multiplication of these two brackets is equal to b raised to 4 minus a raised to 4 by using third identity. Now, students, next question x by 2 plus 3y by 4, x by 2 plus 3y by 4. Here, multiplication of two same brackets. Therefore, we can write bracket square x by 2 plus 3y by 4 bracket square. Now, students, here addition of two terms and bracket square. Therefore, here we can find out product of these two binomials by using first identity. Therefore, by using first identity and first identity is a plus b whole bracket square is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square. Now students, here first term is x by 2, therefore we can write a is equal to x by 2, therefore we have to put a is equal to x by 2. Here second term is 3y by 4, therefore we have to put b is equal to 3y by 4. Now we have to put these values in this identity. Therefore, here a, therefore in place of a we have to put x by 2, x by 2 plus b, b means 3y by 4. 
4 and whole bracket square. Now RHS part A square means x by 2 whole square. x by 2 whole bracket square plus 2 A A means x by 2. Therefore here x by 2. B B means 3 y by 4. Therefore here 3 y by 4. Here plus B square means 3 y by 4 bracket square. Therefore plus 3 y by 4 bracket square. Now students we have to simplify this RHS. Here x by 2 bracket square. Therefore here numerator square and denominator square. Therefore we can write here x square means here x square 2 square means 4 2 into 2 4. Now we have 2 2 cancel. Here multiplication of 3 monomials. Therefore 2 2 cancel. Now x into 3y that is multiplication of numerator. x into 3y therefore here 3xy and denominator 4. Now here fraction square. Numerator square and denominator square. Therefore 3 square that is 9 y square means here y square and denominator 4 means 4 square is equal to 16 therefore so now, this is final answer therefore so now, we can say that multiplication of these two binomials is equal to x square by 4 plus 3xy by 4 plus 9y square by 16 students in this way we can multiply given two binomials by using identity identities. I hope it is clear to you. Thank you and have a nice day.